Today's video, I'm explaining why you may be better off quitting your gym membership if you're looking to lose weight. Imagine this scenario. I give you the keys to your dream car, be it uh, Lamborghini, Ferrari, Aston Martin, or Wienermobile, whatever you want, right? I give you the keys to it. I say, here's the deal. If you can get the fuel light to come on, you win the car. The only catch is every single day, you have to put a few gallons of gas in the tank, regardless of if you're really driving it or how much you're driving it, okay? So what's your strategy? If I gave you that scenario, where's your mind gonna go? It's like, I wanna drain this fuel tank as quickly as possible so I can win my car. Here's the scenario I see every day. People say, all right, go drive that car. I'm gonna buy track time at the local racing track. I'm going to tow the car there, pay for that as well. Then once I get there, I'm just gonna drive mindless laps that I don't have to think about. I'm not really gonna drive fast or anything because I gotta preserve the car after all. I don't wanna drive it into the wall. So I'm just gonna drive endless laps, bored out of my mind. I'll bring some podcasts or something so I can keep my mind occupied. And then when I'm done, I, get, I will uh, tow the car home and it will sit there. This is the equivalent of saying, I'm going to burn fat by working out in a gym. Particularly, I'm thinking like cardio sort of thing. Because what's going on is you're making your ability to increase your caloric expenditure very conditional. It's like, well, I'll be able to do it when I can get to the gym, when I can afford the gym membership, when I can afford the time, if I have the motivation to do that mindless, you know, boring crap work that I really don't feel like doing. All the while you're saying, I'm only gonna do it once in a while. And at the same time, you got stuff coming in. Now, here's why I think you're better off just going outside. Get outside, I don't care what you do, as long as you're doing something. Now all of those conditions fall away. And this is kind of my overall approach to, to exercise in general. I want to use methods and exercises, it doesn't matter what happens in my job, it doesn't matter what happens in my bank account, or my schedule, or my life. My mind is always saying, I've got to be able to train regardless of what happens in the world. World War zombie apocalypse could be going along. I still got to be able to train under any circumstances. And that's what getting outside, walking, running, rollerblading, biking will be able to do for you. All those conditions fall aside. So what really will drain your fuel tank faster? A condition which will say, it's going to cost me a lot of time and money in order to do this a couple times a week or something that I can potentially do an hour or two every single day. What's gonna drain your fuel tank faster? That's the mindset to have. In the next video, I'll be talking about why this exercise strategy may be more important than diet for long-term weight loss and weight, ma weight management. Questions below, be fit, live free.